Hey everybody out there, AF, as you can tell, I'm driving. I'm driving to go catfishing again, back down on Green Island on the Hudson. This time, I'm gonna change it up. I'm not using chicken livers. I'm using some other junk to throw in the water, not literally. I'm talking Slim Jims, cheese, candy, hot dogs. I'm gonna give it a shot. Wish me luck, stay tuned. Go, let's go fishing where the, the goose is. All right, so what do you want to try first? We have gummy sharks, or we have the Slim Jim beef and cheddar. That looks pretty inviting. And heck, if I don't catch a fish, guess what I'm gonna be chomping on for lunch? Ballpark bun size beef franks. Or, <laughs> I had to get these sour neon worms. Let's start off with the hot dog. What do you say? Come on. Get a nice chunk here. Don't really need the knife for that. Could have just ripped it off with my fingers. To, to ring. Sometimes it gets caught in a corner of it and it won't ring. We got one, ladies and gentlemen, on the hot dog. I already set the hook. I was out screwing around again. Ooh. Oh, this is a big one. Come on. Yeah. Come oh, yeah. Holy crap. Wow, <laughs> this is a big one. Oh, fudge, I don't have my forceps. I can't even get my hand around them, fudge. Where are my forceps? Oh, crap, I am not prepared. Oh, you know what? I did bring these. Ah. Hey, there's my bell. <laughs> Gloves. I don't want to snap the hook. Did I? I did. There we go. All right, I got the hook fully extracted. Oh yeah, huh? On the hot dog. Nice cat. That's that's pushing two feet. <laughs> He's a dirty mess. I gotta put him back. Wow, that's a rush. Holy crap. All right, the hot dog worked. So let's move on to something different. What do you say we snap into a Slim Jim? <laughs> Well, the cheese side wants to come out first. Imagine, imagine if I threw in the whole stick like this. <sighs> anyway. Noise. Did I tell you I found my bell from the other day? <laughs> I can prove it. This one's on the cheese. Oh, jeez. Oh, there it is. 
over there. A little bit smaller than the first one, but let's get in here. Oh, oh yeah. All right. Woo! All right, come on. No, no, no. Stop. There, all right. Second cat of the day, smaller, on the cheddar. <laughs> ah! Sorry. Cat number two, hot dog and cheddar. Booyah! Let's try the Slim Jim now, huh? <laughs> I'm thinking if we had luck on a hot dog and cheddar cheese, this delicious piece of processed tubular meat is gonna do the trick too. And there ain't no way that's coming off the hook. Double hooked. scored me a free hook. Ha! Come to think of it, it looks very familiar and new. I wonder if it's one of mine from the other day. <laughs> yep. <laughs> yeah, it was mine. And here's the accompanying barrel weight that, or not barrel weight, whatever, sinker, egg sinker, whatever it's called. Yeah, that was definitely my hook and now my own weight from the other day. Here's some more little freebies I found. Three of these chartreuse jig heads. I don't know guys, I have no luck so far on the Slim Jim. I might have to switch it up to one of the two remaining baits, the uh, gummy sharks and the gold. All right guys, so the, the Slim Jim didn't work, believe it or not. So I'm gonna switch it up to the third, fourth kind of bait today the sour neon gummy worm and oh yes they are sour let's get that bad boy <laughs> i should texas rig it don't i sound all fisherman all right look at that huh chartreuse green or yellow and green let's give it a shot first cast on the gummy worm Didn't realize you guys had uh, schmegma on the lens. <laughs> Groovy. All right. Come on, gummy worm, you gotta work. <sighs> Who doesn't like a good gummy worm every once in a while? Eh? I don't understand why people bring glass bottles, uh, presumably beer bottles, to fish and then break them or leave them behind. It's like, if you're gonna drink beer or whatever, do it, bring a can at least or something. This stuff is deadly, potentially deadly. So I've been, I've been picking up glass while I've been waiting for the bell to ding, been cleaning up the beach, my civic duty. Somebody's been stealing my gummy worms. I've lost two already. And the, the pole didn't bob or anything. And I figured, well, geez, maybe the, the worm is disintegrating in the water. So I threw one in right where I can see it. And no, it's just, it's intact. I don't know what's going on down there. So Sticky. You know what? I think they are disintegrating. What the flip? Yeah. All right, so here's the deal. This is what's going on. When I'm reeling it in, the movement, it's just tearing it right off the hook. Okay, I got it. I got it. It is gummy shark time. Gummy shark number one. Woo! 
brilliant cast. Brilliant. Brilliant. Something's tugging. See the old guy the old guy behind me? Huh. Some definite definite disintegration going on here. Yeah. All right, candy is, it's just not worth continuing. It's, it's just disintegrating. Um, I think a logical last thing to try is a meat and cheese combo. I know I can't resist that. Hot dog and cheddar. These uh, hot dogs have had quite a while to warm up. They're kind of come flying right off the hook. Well, I'd say in the battle of candy, Slim Jim, hot dog, and cheese, I'm gonna proclaim the winner the cheese, and I'll tell you why. It caught a fish, and the best part is it stays on the hook more easily. The hot dogs keep on coming off, uh, the candy dissolves and didn't catch anything, so that's next that idea. I got some more cheese on right now, so like I said, I'm gonna have to go with the cheese as a go-to bait. Oh. Hey everybody, thanks for watching. Stay tuned for the next video. In the meantime, click like, subscribe, and comment if you'd like. Adios!